Hello and welcome to the channel that covers everything where health and technology meet. Today we have a really quick video, but something that's asked quite a bit, and that's what happens to the Peloton when you cancel your subscription. So just so you know how this video is gonna flow, really quick, I'm gonna cover what it's like when you have the subscription. That way anybody that's not real familiar with the Peloton knows what the basic layout looks like and you have a before idea, so when you see the after, you know what you're losing and you have a before and after comparison. So let's jump into the before and I'll show you what that looks like real quick. So when you're a Peloton subscriber, there's all sorts of data and content available to you. And as an example on the home screen here, you can see all the different categories of content or history. You can see about the rides you've done, the achievements you've met, and just different things to see about what you've been doing. But from there, they have all sorts of different types of content breakouts. So you can see the various rides that are available, filtered down to all sorts of different contents as well as programs live rides there are just a lot of different things you can do with a peloton subscription and this includes other content not just meant for the bike itself there's also scenic rides available and from there we're going to take a look at the just ride screen take note of this because it's going to look familiar here in just a second no special peloton bells and whistles just stats on the screen so now i've canceled the peloton subscription and as of filming this video you actually can't do it on the peloton itself you have to go to their website and do it there not hard but just so you know but before I show you the after cancellation, if you could hit that like button for me, huge assist for the channel, and I really appreciate it. So this is what you'll see if your bike is not activated, and take note of where it says Just Ride in red near the bottom. So if I click that, this is the screen you'll get, and it's that same Just Ride screen I showed you earlier. So if you're not a paying member to Peloton, this is the mode you get, and this is basically the only mode you get. But you do still have all the metrics so that you can use the sensors, you can see your cadence, you can see your resistance, you can see the output they calculate as well as some of the base numbers that add up over the course of the ride, total output, speed, and things like that. Like I said, that was going to be a quick one. Hopefully you found it beneficial and if you did, please hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to stay on top of everything health and technology. Until next time, here's to a healthier you and have a good one.